Takeoff. One third of Migos Rap Trio died November 1st after a shooting took place in Houston, Texas. The fatal shooting happened around 2.30 a.m. Immediately afterwards, local police began receiving calls from multiple sources about a man shot at a bowling alley called 810 Billards and Bowling Houston. For discharging firearms. Wait to be paid up for There's five shots fired downstairs, from downstairs, uh, outside, near 2004. The people next door are calling in about discharging firearms. It's not next door, it's from... a. Uh, 2202. When police showed up to the scene, 28-year-old Kirshnik Kari Ball, who went by the name of Takeoff, was pronounced dead. It was reported he had suffered a gunshot wound near his head. His uncle Cuevo, another rapper in the Migos rap trio, can be seen walking around frantically on the phone. Police confirmed that at least two other people had been shot and were being treated at a nearby hospital. The names of those victims have not been released yet. A few hours before the murder took place, Cuevo uploaded a video of himself driving around Houston's 5th Ward in a convertible car with Jazz Prince and two other passengers, celebrating Jazz Prince's birthday, the son of American music executive James Prince. Yo, we slide through the town, man. We slide through the town. Now we get down. Got the birthday boy with me. Yeah, also. Yo, we on the 5th. Yeah, Jazz Prince had also shared a post on his story, bowling party tonight at 9pm, DM for details. This is the last picture taken of Takeoff before the fatal shooting. It was stated, Takeoff and Cuevo were enjoying their private party with 40 plus people in 810 billiards and bowling in downtown Houston. Around 2.30am, Takeoff was seen playing dice with a few other people when a fight broke out. Suddenly, gunshots began ringing through the bowling alley, involving at least two guns. In the shootout, a bullet struck Takeoff either in his head or neck, instantly causing him to begin bleeding out. As of now, there is no information leading to the arrest of the gunman involved in the shooting. Police are requesting at least one of those 40 attendees to come forth with any possible information about the shooting.